Today I'm going to mount um, watercolour paper onto this Da Vinci birch wood painting panel. Um, I got a box of them in Jerry's Artorama sale and decided it would be a fun thing to play with. So I've already gone ahead and painted my, my naked birch panel with Liquitex black acrylic. Um, I think a coat of paint for the edges just gives it a much more finished look. And to mount my watercolour paper, I'm just using this acrylic medium. Um, you can use Mod Podge or Yes or any glue really that um, works for decoupage. Now you can see this is a reject painting. Uh, this is a really good way to use up those odds and ends that you have um, from little experiments or paintings that you just didn't just didn't work out for whatever reason. So I'm just using my palette knife to give not too much of a coating but reasonably generous all the way to the edge. need to make sure I line this up right because acrylic medium dries fast. Um, now there is a teeny tiny um, gap where the paper wasn't quite wide enough for this but I'm okay with that. So this is just a tool for squashing it down, making sure there's no air bubbles. You could use a brayer, a bone folder, the edge of a ruler, anything that works. I'm just going to mop up the edge. And that looks like it's glued down all oh, except that corner. always one. I'm just going to run this under here. Um, draw it out. Now, oh, it doesn't want to stick. So what I'm going to do is put this underneath a very heavy book. For several hours uh, until it's dried and I should have a fully adhered piece of uh, paper to my wood panel. This, this is uh, what I was using to hold down these papers while they dried out. As you can see there are no bubbles and it's on there. It's pretty solid. So I'm really happy with that. That was a good result. Um, I do know you can stick paper to um, two panels after it's been painted and it's fine um, that's what I did with this one I painted it then stuck it down because you know what's an experiment without risk <laughs> um, but it was fine obviously acrylic gouache dries permanent there's no there's nothing I can put on here that's going to um, reactivate that paint. So my next test will be with regular watercolour to see how that does and also um, water soluble ink uh, just to see, just to test it out. Um, I hope you find this useful and uh, as always thanks for watching.